So I've not made a Kid Leroy video in quite some time. He's been previewing this brand new song he has called Girls, which just sounds like an absolute smash hit. So like, comment, and subscribe, and let's just jump into all the Leroy updates. So the last few weeks, Leroy has started up the US leg of the first time tour. I absolutely can't wait for the Omaha show, which is the one that I'm going to on July 10th. Now, unfortunately, some of the dates recently had to be canceled and rescheduled uh, at the end of the tour because some of Leroy and his team got COVID, which is kind of crazy in 2024 but everything should be fine. The, the tour is still fine and everything. Leroy's also been doing just a few other random side missions and collabs, including a brand new Air One smoothie with the Kid Leroy Girls smoothie, which is out now at all locations that you can get. He also has a Nardwar interview that he did. The full interview is not out yet, but there was just a clip of it, which was pretty funny. And before game one of the Stanley Cup finals, he performed uh, outside the Florida Panthers arena and got to go to the game, which I mean, that's probably more fun than the NBA finals because the finals have been trash this year the Stanley Cup's honestly better this year but the song that I talked about girls that he's been previewing I'll throw up a snippet if for some reason you haven't heard it yet I also assume that this song just interprets uh, Sydney Lapper's uh, girls just want to have fun I mean that's just the first thing I think of when I hear this snippet there's about a million different snippets and TikToks to this song by now he's been previewing it and performing it so much he did say on his most recent TikTok that the song is gonna be dropping solo and it's gonna be dropping this month in June so most likely I assume next week's the 21st. I don't know about that. I'm just gonna guess the latest date in June, which is the 28th. That just seems the most likely. I thought maybe Jack Harlow would just be an absolute smash feature for this, but I'm fine with it being solo. I'm so glad it's finally releasing after all this, you know, teasing and hyping up of the song. But great news about this song that the video was actually being shot yesterday. There's a little bit of behind the scenes. So, I mean, we are so close to the song and I can't wait to react to it on stream. Potentially, we're gonna have someone in the music video starring in it and I feel like it's most likely going to be Tate McRae. It would make the most sense because the song's pretty much about her, I assume. And Tate McRae is obviously his girlfriend. Honestly, props to the kid. That's an absolute bag right there. You can't even lie. I was kind of wondering, you know, what does this song kind of lead into? What exactly is Leroy doing next project-wise? It could be a handful of different things. Just for him to tweet the other day, summer album on the way. Which definitely confuses me because I thought, you know, like a couple months ago, you know, we're like, is the deluxe still coming? I, you know, I thought maybe the deluxe is canceled and everything. And he says, you know, hey, the deluxe is catered to you guys. It's going to be 10 songs. Don't worry. You know, it's still coming out. We're getting all the dates and everything. But I just feel like at this point, like we're in June, man. Like I'm fine with him putting out girls and maybe another single and doing a summer album because there's so many good snippets that could end up on a summer album, a little mixtape or something like that. If he can put hatred with Yachty on official streaming platforms and then you put link up, loving you, pick sides, love you now, that'd be a great project. It'd be, you know, him dropping another project like he said he was going to in 2024. And it'll give him time to work on the next, you know, full-length concept album, Scum. Then I just want to talk about a couple new snippets where I'm really confused where this deluxe intro is gonna go. It kind of sounds like a sorry part two. And this is what he tweeted out in April. And also, I wonder where this Nights Like This Part 2 snippet, yes, Nights Like This Part 2 is a real thing. Which is so awesome because the original Nights Like This was always one of my favorite Leroy songs. And it's been gaining traction recently, I think just on TikTok. I've definitely just seen the popularity of this song rise a lot more. I mean, if my little sister's playing Nights Like This, she definitely got it off TikTok, you know. But other than that, that's pretty much all of the Leroy updates. Uh, more videos on the way soon. We're on the grind this summer. Thank you guys for watching all the way to the end of the video. I have a Twitter, Instagram. Go check me out there. Subscribe to my channels. And I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.